Now for the news for the September 19th. Be sure to watch the Bullvine today as we will cover the Premier National Junior Show in Harrisburg. Special attention will be paid to Reese Burdett, who will be showing at this show after her miraculous recoveries from her terrible accident. The Whitaker family and their Knowles Merford had an outstanding day at the UK Dairy Days, claiming both the Grand Champion and Red and White Champion titles. Judge Giuseppe Quani chose Knowles Mayor Goldwyn Akarabum as the intermediate and grand champion. She was imported as embryos from the Canadian cow Kingsway Dunday Abracadabra. In Class 3 trade at Chicago Mercantile Exchange, Merck futures were lower as contracts continued to back off on recent highs. Production is also rising along with seasonal lines, and many areas of the USDA recently raised production estimates for the fourth quarter of this year. Dairy farmers have endured one of their worst years ever, but Fonterra is set to have record revenues. World Business Research, a group of universities and colleges behind the Farm Business Survey, have found that dairy farmers in the top 25% performance category made 450 more pounds of profit per cow in 2015 in the UK in the last year. Fresh cows being one of the more fragile and suppressed groups of cattle on your dairy farm, pen moves shouldn't be taken lightly. Research from the University of Wisconsin School of Veterinary Medicine lists reducing pen moves among the top five keys to preventing poor fresh cow transition. Eddie Spirits of Erie County, Pennsylvania took home the first place in the 19th Annual Youth Film Chip Contest during the 2016 All-American Dairy Show at the Pennsylvania Farm Show Complex and Expo Center in Harrisburg. 